People hate to try something they know that they could fail at, but without taking a risk and getting out of your comfort zone, you can't get better. Today, I want you to learn why it's important to love losing. From an early age, schooling instills in us an attitude that failure is bad. If you didn't pass your spelling test, it hurts your grade. Enough bad grades hurts your progress. I found this outlook to in turn make people scared to try new things that they might fail at. This pattern keeps them doing the same things that they feel comfortable with doing, the same things that they're good at. There's a quote often attributed to Thomas Edison that goes, I have not failed a thousand times, I have not failed once. I've succeeded in proving that there's a thousand ways that it won't work. When I've eliminated the ways that won't work, I'll find the way that will work. Now, whether that's an accurate quote or not, the takeaway is the same. If you adopt a mindset that in every failure you're getting closer to success, you'll find yourself happier in quote unquote failure. In my early marketing days, I began to implement this in many different marketing campaign tests. Early in my career, I found myself creating landing pages for different sales funnel promotions. Each landing page was used in an A-B test. What I learned was that while there's definitely a wrong answer, there are also right answers and more right answers. This mindset can be applied over and over again to the different risks that you take. Let's say you're applying for your first position out of school. You have submitted 40 plus resumes, and seriously, I mean it, I know a few people who've submitted probably close to 100 before actually landing a job. You need to understand that sometimes it's just a numbers game. And with every rejection, you're getting closer and closer to acceptance. If you got passed up on, sweet, on to the next one. For me, losing creates this fire inside that spurs my competition spirit. Most of that competition is just with myself. This helps me maintain composure in losing. So don't fear a loss. Don't be scared to try something or take a new risk. Chances are you won't hit a home run on your first at bat chances are you won't land a job with your first resume. You will lose on many occasions in your life. Get comfortable with it. Adopt a mindset where you love to lose because you understand you're one step closer to success. Now, this is rant number two in a series of four that I'm working on uh, and helping you become a unique breed. Hit the subscribe button to be notified when the next rant in this series is available and check out the previous episode in this series about saying yes. That's it for me today. Learn to take an L. That's it.